Hey guys, um, skip this, skip this uh, video if you want just fluff and happiness and things like that. Um, this is a negative uh, video. Uh, remember I said, uh, oftentimes I say I don't sugarcoat anything, but, um, and most of the time our stuff is really kind of positive, but man, I am just, I'm just so tired. I'm really tired. I mean, I filmed this once and I use the F word every maybe five seconds or 10 seconds. I am so tired of people who just trash our national forests, our land as Americans. I almost said the F word. Um, really, I mean, first of all, nomads. I've been doing this for quite a while right now and with Marvy. And I, I do see some nomads that are pigs. Uh, but the majority of people, we understand to protect the areas that we're living in. This is where we live. We don't want to lose it. But whether we're fishing on a lake or camping, you've got the weekend yahoos that want to come out here for America and they want to go camping and they leave all of their, I am going to use one word, shit all over the place. And it's people uh, like the nomads or the park services that have to pick up their lazy ass garbage. And um, I did, I've just spent the last hour and a half doing it here. You've seen some other videos of ours. Uh, if you look at Craggy Wash, uh, that video on our, a couple years ago, I had to pick up some horrible, horrible stuff. But, um, we're at this beautiful area in Colorado, uh, almost at 11,000 feet, uh, near Twin Lakes. Uh, lots of camping around, lots of campers trying to enjoy themselves. But then we roll into a campsite that's all ours, and you can see this, and there is garbage everywhere, everywhere. And uh, let me show you a few things. I'm going to tilt the camera down. Let me see if I can do this. I could just cut away, but I want to show you live. This is just some of the stuff I've collected so far. And, uh, you know, it's nice that people put things in a bag, but when you leave the bag behind, like, who the hell do you think is going to clean this up? Huh? Really? Come on. We're not your mama. If you're watching this and you're just a Yahoo weekend camper, you know, get a life. Okay? So, I'm, I'm sorry, let me calm down again. Here's another thing. All right. Okay, so we had a couple of these left behind. Um, obviously, 4th of July is out having a nice time. If you really care about America, why are you leaving this crap behind? If you are really a true American and you love our country, what were you thinking? What are you thinking that you just leave this stuff behind? These were hanging on a tree, and people obviously left them. They left a cot. They left a, uh, all of this stuff, cardboard, styrofoam, um, tennis shoes, um, cans of chicken salad, uh, even a half-open can of Coke. Why didn't you finish the Coke? I don't really care about that, but... Anyway, and then up here, I'll show you, cut away to the video while I'm talking. Somebody was nice enough to be ecological and use a portable toilet they probably bought from Walmart. The only problem is they left it here. Ugh. I mean, this is disgusting. How is, I'm not, I'm sorry, I will not take that back. All of this stuff, I'm going to package up package up the best we can and then once we get to get ready to break camp we will go down and we will find some place where no one's looking and illegally use a dumpster to get rid of this stuff thank you very much so okay that's it i'm sorry guys um there's a storm coming in i still have work to do um we got a good video coming up on leadville um on wednesday but i wanted to get this one up probably Hopefully, maybe tomorrow night, which would be Sunday, uh, so you could see what it is. 
I think we may just leave early in the morning and head south. Uh, this area is very disappointing to me. Um, so please, folks, if you're camping, please be considerate to other people. And if you see someone really doing this stuff, be bold if you feel it's safe. Of course, make sure it's safe and confront them and tell them to take their garbage in. Be polite about it, but explain to them that other people are going to be using it too and you'd appreciate it if they left the campsite with all of their garbage. I know that's a very hard thing to do in America today with everybody having guns and that we're so divided politically. So I don't blame you if you don't, but for many of us that live on the road and respect the land, um, this is just so sad and very disappointing. All right, we'll see you guys soon.